As far back as I can remember, I always wanted to be a gangster. One day, one day some of the kids from the neighborhood carried my mother's groceries all the way home. You know why? It was out of respect. Once the campsite's wiped out, I know it's going to be the same for us. You ever cross the road and look the wrong way? Give me that fucking shooter! Then, hey presto, there's a car nearly on you. So what do you do? Something very silly. You freeze. And your life doesn't flash before you because you're too fucking scared to think. You just freeze and pull a stupid face. But the pikey didn't. Why? Because he had plans on running the car over. Change it. It was typical Ace. He invited the biggest people in town and he knew they'd show. Because he knew they all wanted something from him. With Ace, nobody ever got a free ride. Even Ginger. With her, he still covered his bets. They had to have the baby first before they could get married. He even made Jenny and me watch Amy for a few days when they went on their honeymoon. But I didn't mind, we loved the kid. Picture and we think her platinum blonde locks and hot jazz baby doll style are gonna make her a big star.
shots. How he can survive them, nobody knows. No man can endure this pummeling. The fight is stopped on. Jimmy was cutting every link between himself and the robbery, but it had nothing to do with me. I gave Jimmy the tip and he gave me some Christmas money. From then on, I kept my mouth shut. I knew Jimmy. He had the cash. It was his. I know he kicked some money upstairs to Paulie, but that was it. <laughs>